Problem 13. Two different numbers are randomly selected from the set and multiplied together. What is the probability that the product is 0? Well, in order for any two numbers multiplied together to give 0, one of them must be 0 itself, right? And that's just, you know, basic common sense. So we have what? We have negative 2, negative 1, 0, 3, 4, and 5. What is the probability are randomly selected? So I'm, I'm going to assume that there is replacement, right? So uh, two different numbers are randomly selected. Okay, two different numbers. So that means there there is no replacement. So how many do we have in total? We have one, two, three, four, five, six. How many ways are there to choose a non-zero number? We have one, two, three, four, five. We have five over six possibilities. But then we only have one way um, to to choose a number. Or let's solve a complementary counting. We have five over six ways, right? Five or six ways the probability of choosing a non-zero number. So what is the other probability of choosing a non-zero number? Well, let's say I chose negative two. Then I have one, two, three, four, five remaining, but then I can only choose four of them. But then this will give me the product. This will give me the probability that I choose two numbers that are non-zero. So one minus this probability will give us our answer. So this is equal to one minus two over three. Therefore, this is one over three. Therefore, your final answer will be answer choice D.